Hey, this is Mark, and you're welcome to Odysseys. People think the car industry changes slowly, but tonight, I want you to imagine something that feels almost impossible. A future where the steering wheel is nothing more than a decoration. A future that quietly started the moment Tesla showed FSD V14 in that flawless robo-taxi ride of Fremont. A moment so smooth and so silent that even Wall Street analysts couldn't hide the fear in their excitement. And before we dive into why this moment could be the biggest turning point since Henry Ford rolled out the first mass production Model T in 1908, hit that like button and subscribe, because what you're about to hear may change the way you look at every car on the road. Now, picture this. An investor sitting in the back seat of a Tesla, hands nowhere near the wheel, heart pounding as the car pulls into the hotel driveway without a single hiccup. That moment triggered Piper Sandler to reaffirm their $500 target, calling the software truly impressive. But let's be honest, impressive is too soft. What they saw was the start of a financial earthquake. And like all earthquakes, the first tremor feels small until everything starts shaking. That's act one, the spark. Now, here's where Act 2 tightens the chest. Wall Street isn't arguing if autonomy will take over, they're arguing how fast. And that's where fear and money collide. Melius Research came out saying Tesla is now a must-own, not because of cars, but because they believe tens of billions of dollars are about to move from legacy automakers to Tesla. Think about that. Car companies once considered untouchable, GM, Ford, Toyota, now look like players standing on the wrong side of history. It's not just hype, it's math. Bank of America's valuation breaks Tesla down like a tech company, 45% of its value tied to robo-taxis, 17% to FSD, only 12% to the actual cars. If that doesn't make you pause for a breath, here's a pattern interrupt. Imagine explaining to your grandkids that the car company of your generation was really a robot company wearing a shiny EV costume. Funny, but also terrifying, because it shows how quickly the old rules are dying. Meanwhile, Tesla is rolling out new chip designs, building AI4 today and AI5 for mid-2027. Musk even said Tesla will one day produce more AI chips than every other chip maker combined. Sounds crazy, right? But then again, people also called Ford's assembly line crazy until it crushed every competitor who laughed. And that leads us deeper into the suspense. Tesla securing approval to run commercial ride-hailing in Arizona. This is not a test. This is not a lab dream. This is the first crack in the door of a trillion dollar transportation market. And if you really want to thrill, consider this. Tesla's next Gigafactory line in Texas is planned for 10 million vehicles a year. 10. Million. Vehicles. A scale so aggressive it forces you to wonder if everyone else has already lost the race and just doesn't know it yet. But not everyone is convinced, and that's where the tension peaks. Truist warns Tesla's physical AI, FSD, RoboTaxis, Optimus, still brings almost zero revenue today. Zero. That's the cliff the story is standing on, the moment in every great three-act structure where everything could fall apart. If autonomy stumbles, even for a moment, Tesla's future looks dangerously exposed. Investors know this, analysts know this, and Tesla definitely knows this. That fear is real. But here's the twist. The same fear that could break Tesla is also the fire behind its most explosive growth. Because every demo, every sensor upgrade, every chip design pushes the company closer to the point of no return, where robo-taxis shift from idea to unstoppable reality. And that leaves us standing at Act 3, the rise. When Wedbush assigned a $600 price target, they basically said the quiet part out loud. If Tesla hits these AI milestones, if it unlocks even a fraction of its robo-taxi plan, if it reaches 20 million vehicles and a million autonomous taxis, then Tesla won't just be a car company, it will be one of the most powerful AI companies ever created. And the craziest part? We are watching the beginning in real time. Imagine looking back years from now and saying you were alive when driving, actual driving, started becoming old technology. It feels unreal, almost like science fiction, but that's exactly why it's thrilling. Everything we know about cars, ownership, insurance, commuting, even personal freedom, might change faster than anyone expects. And whether Tesla succeeds or fails, the ground beneath the entire automotive industry is already cracking. The question is not what happens to Tesla, it's what happens to everyone else when the future arrives and they're still building the past. And if you want to stay ahead of that future, keep watching, because this story is just getting started.